I am Game Guy. It's time for more Let's Play Pikmin 2, the challenge mode zone. Three left. This is gonna be it. Uh, let's just uh, get it going. Bully Den. Is this the one I'm thinking of? I know there's one that I haven't encountered yet. So it's gotta be one of these last three. I think this is it, actually. Alright. Are we ready? It's purple time. Welcome to the final floor. Alright. What exactly am I looking at here? Also, wow, there's a large amount of time. Uh, that's pretty cool. And this, yeah, if this is the one I think it is, this is the one where you're gonna want to be quick at breaking down walls for reasons, so, you know... I don't know if you can figure out what I'm putting down here. Maybe you can. My problem, though, is I do not yet know where the key is, so that's going to be a thing. Dweevils are hiding in the corridors. I do not know of what color they are, though. This is kind of a problem in a way, because it's like, I don't yet see what it is I am to do. All will be made apparent shortly, I'm sure. Um, yep, alright, in case you didn't figure it out, we got Water Wraith going on. The joke being, you start with purples, so you can just kind of deal with that. Also, there's a, an Anode Dweevil falling from the ceiling, so that's interesting. Alright, I kind of want to get out of here, because I'm afraid he's going to just start rolling around again. He just does that at a certain point in time. Alright. Just break that off. Now we gotta chase him around. Oh, there's two of you now? There's more of you now? The danger here, obviously, is the fact that, um... When you pound the ground, it lodges things from the ceiling. I think I've explained this before. So, you know, you gotta be a little bit on the careful side of life. By the way, I don't know if you can hear it, but there is a second one around somewhere. I do not know where he's at. But I feel like he's nearby because I can hear him. There he is. Okay, this is problems, actually. They shouldn't regrow their um, steamroller, so... I'm not really sure where he's at. But yeah, I'm pretty sure there's just two of these guys here reasons. Uh-oh. I wasn't ready because I got stunned. That's always fun. Well, I mean, it didn't matter too much because, I mean, you're pretty much dead at this point. Alright. I need to defeat you still, though. Like, that's kind of a thing I still need to do. We gotta bully this guy, guys. Guy, guy, guys. We gotta bully the guy, guys. We gotta do it. Bully the guy. The other guy is probably still running around somewhere. Wanna, wanna come back? Fortunately, purples are pretty slow, so I kind of really wish you weren't like running around over here. Hi, Dweevil. Uh, I hope none of my Pikmin die as a result of your existence. They probably will, cause I wasn't ready for you, and I have leaves. Somehow I didn't lose any Pikmin. I'm not exactly sure how, but you know what? There's a frog now! That's pretty exciting. I have a threat to take care of real quick. Get out of here, please. <laughs> I uh, do not... Oh, hello. Oh, well, we've got both of you here. Oh, there's another unknown Dweevil. That's pretty cool. I don't know if Bitter Spray actually works on you guys. I don't think so. This is just a weird floor, because it's like, oh man, we got two water wraiths hanging out here in the zone. One of them is dead. He gave me the baby doll head, so that's cool. Alright, 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 alright. Let's clean up here. I need... First off, I'm missing Pikmin somewhere. I'm not exactly sure where they are. What is, what is happening? Why are you guys going after that? I want to kill this guy. I can't kill this guy if you just decide to ignore him. 
That's just not how this works. Alright, is there anything beyond there? There is something beyond here. While that's going, it's gonna be done before I have much of a chance to do anything. I wanna find where those Pikmin are. They're back at the base? Alright. Fair enough. We gotta we gotta collect some stuff now, cause that's just kinda what's left at this point. I got real lucky with the dweebles, by the way. Uh, cause this could have gone real bad, real quick. All right, one Pikmin there, one Pikmin there, one Pikmin there, one Pikmin there. Just Pikmin everywhere, honestly. I think I threw a Pikmin that just didn't do anything. It's hard to tell, honestly. I just want to get these moving. I, I don't care necessarily if they're slow. Partially because I know that there's probably dweebles in here somewhere. There's a thing hiding in there. I don't know where the dweevil is. Has anybody seen a dweevil? Because it clearly... Oh, here we are. I was going to say, I know there's a dweevil. I can hear it. Oh, the geyser's behind that wall that I just abandoned, so that's cool. <laughs> Alright. Oh, hello. Just more anode dudes. I'm really glad y'all exist. I, I kind of am not, actually, because you messed up my little convoy of stuff. Alright, grab that. I pressed A, but I guess it didn't want to. Uh... I mean, it really doesn't matter. I just want to make sure I get everything. It's just unfortunate that I keep, like, missing. Just grab everything, please. I don't know where you're going. Just grab the thing. Just, just grab the thing. I think that's everything. If not, whatever. Alright, I'm gonna leave these guys here so that hopefully they just break the geyser while I'm gone. Alright. Um, there is more to be had over here. I, please move slightly over to the side so you can grab these, thanks. Did you guys go after the geyser? Some of you did. I, I do want to get this done. So I have an escape route once I am ready. Grab the baby doll! Do it, please! Okay. Alright, uh, there's bound to be something over here. I heard a dweevil. Honestly, I guess there's not much of anything left, so I'm just gonna take my loss. Not really a loss, but like, just go. There's no doubt more treasure somewhere, because I didn't hear the noise, but... I mean... I will accept this as the end result. See, I did good. Almost got to 30k, but pretty good and it's a perfect oh yeah all right well at this point I don't remember any more challenge zone levels so I guess the game's gonna freeze what what happened <laughs> Okay, I can't hit the reset button. I have to turn the Wii off straight up. Great. I don't know what that was about, but uh, freaking my Wii hard crashed and I had to completely shut it off, so that's a thing. Uh, it saved my score, though, so that's fun. Uh, sniper room, let's go. <laughs> Alright, there's only one one floor here. Just one. Ooh. Nighttime outside. Weird that you call it a room, but okay. Um, interesting. Somehow they haven't used like a nighttime appearance outside yet. It's weird, I would think. Oh, that kind of sniper. Alright, well, I mean, I've got purples, so I'm gonna just not 
throw purples, apparently. It just seemed like the thing to do. Yeah, I had a feeling I would lose some there. I, uh, I was expecting to switch to throwing purples at some point during that, and I just didn't. So that made me sad. Oh gosh, don't put one on top of the bucket. They put one on top of the bucket. Okay, I see what the problem is here. Um, everybody sit over here for the moment. I'm gonna use Boulder Man. Oh gosh, that's probably not gonna work, is it? If I, if I shoot a boulder, where is it gonna go? Uh, not anywhere, apparently. Man, I kind of wish the red guy was anywhere near uh, freaking that guy over there. All right, fine. Uh, gosh, I'd love... Did I hear the sound of a Gatling groink? I thought I did, but maybe I don't. All right, you wanna, you wanna spit a boulder ever? It's like, if you're just not gonna, then I'm gonna just go ahead and throw Pikmin on you until you die, but... Bringing purples is not really my best idea, to be honest, because... You know, I'm gonna have to... Wrangle them around, make sure I don't throw them instead, because they are not gonna make the throw. As it turns out. It's a, a bit of a thing. This guy is not as much of a threat as I thought he might be, it turns out, but he's still kind of a nuisance. I was gonna say, that should be the end of him. Let's get him down. I'm very surprised that was not where the key was, though. Uh, I have purples and a bitter spray, so I can give this a shot. I kind of want you to do the ground pound, but you actually didn't do it. I'm not gonna trust that. Maybe I should have, in hindsight, because I realize there's more level now. He was almost dead anyway. There is a Gatling Groink. I thought I heard one. Well, really cool. Um. Well, I mean, the key is right here. Let's just grab that. I didn't need to throw that many. It's fine. Yeah, just get that going, because that should be able to make it, no problem. I almost don't even feel like fighting the Groink, because, like, I mean, he's gonna be a problem, but he's not the biggest of thing. We'll see what happens, because, uh, oh, I missed. Nice. I swear, throwing Pikmin on top of these guys has been really weird lately. Alright, I need to separate, because, uh, it's obviously gonna happen when I'm right up against a wall! A lot of my yellows are not here. Where are all my yellows? Did I, I send them all back? I mean, yeah, I'm aware I, um, I did send them somewhere, but, you know. Okay. I'm gonna need you guys run away. I don't know the best course of action to deal with this guy right about now. I need more yellows. I, I can't really do much right now. Is that right where my purples are? Because that's pretty cool. I mean, they're with Louie, so they're not going to do anything yet, but you know. Alright, please cease and desist. I need to get my other yellows back. Uh, I'm gonna need to do something here. I still have an amount of time, so I'm not really all that concerned right now. Can you guys make it over here? You can, but I kind of want all of you. Boy, I'm not getting a lot done, unfortunately. Uh, Louis, yeah, you're just right next to this thing. You may as well just break that open while I try to make my way back. Uh, thing is, it's like, I'd carry stuff back, but to be fair, I don't even need to kill the Groink. I just want to. It's kind of a thing, because it's like, I don't even need to kill him. There's so much treasure just not even anywhere near him, and I'm just ignoring it all. 
To be fair, I also don't have a lot of time, turns out. So like, I'm not even really sure what I would do with this time. So I guess I'm just gonna go for the treasure and forget about the groink, cause I mean, what else am I gonna do? I don't have the time necessary to deal with him and also get all of this stuff. I mean, I could try, but I just, I don't, Especially with purples, these guys are slow, and I'm just gonna kinda not worry about it right now. Uh, yeah, grab that. I don't really need you getting nectar right now, but uh, thanks, I guess. Alright. Grab this. Th oh, hello! We have a guest! I wasn't expecting a guest uh, to this place. All right, fine, uh, be that way, guy. I can just throw Pikmin at you and you won't do much about it. I'm not really a big fan of that bomb placement, but I've had worse, I guess. Purples are good at fighting, but man, they're still pretty slow. Um, all right, I don't need all of you on that. Grab the, the grab that thing, please. May as well grab him, I guess. Come on, Olmar. Actually, one of you really should stay closer to um, the the goal, because I guess that's all I'm doing today is just collecting the treasures I've earned and leave it at that. This place is freaking huge, actually. Like, half the reason why this is a problem is because it's just so large. Like, if I didn't have to make a freaking 10-mile trek to get to anywhere, this wouldn't really be a problem. Of course you need 10. Why wouldn't you need anything other than that? I mean, I can take some purples, I guess. Alright, guys. Join me over here to help carry the treasures across the way. You know, I mean, just look at this. I'm having a real hard time just even doing this. Alright, I need to make my way back to the, the geyser, though. This is about as much as I'm gonna get. I mean, it's regrettable. There's a whole lot of stuff here that I could get if I were cool, but unfortunately, I'm just not that cool, I guess. Alright, guys. Hurry it along. I kind of wanted you to, you know, hang out, maybe help out with the incoming treasures. Or at least that one. Just, just at least that one there. Just at least get that one. Hey, I mean, that's fine. I'm not happy with this score, but I mean... I just didn't leave myself enough time. I needed to be way more efficient somehow, and I'm not exactly sure the best way to do that. Wow, uh, I got better than I thought, actually, because I thought I was like well below 20K, so never mind whatever I was about to say. <laughs> All right, well, that place looked neat. Uh, you didn't get to ever see a nighttime outside in a hole zone. Anyway, finally, Emperor's Realm, five floors of torment and misery. I have no idea what to expect other than, I mean, something that's very likely to happen. Uh, okay. What do we got going on here? Ah, good, it's playing Bull Black's Kingdom, the song. The experience. All right. Well, uh, I can take care of this guy relatively quickly. Because the game gave me purples, so why not? Uh, somehow, nobody got set on fire. I'm not really sure what happened, if I'm being honest. Because it really kind of feels like I should have got burned there, but I didn't. I, I mean, I'm not going to complain, obviously, but... Still? All right, uh, this place, okay, there's more over there. I was gonna say, this place doesn't seem that big, so I'm not real sure what the, uh, the gimmick is here. Not yet, anyway. 
There is yet more friendly friends over here. How many purples do I got? Not enough, really. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back before I fight Fuzz Pants and uh, recollect my troops. As it is, it seems as though this is all that there is, and I've got a decent chunk of time left, so it's pretty good. I should be able to get through this without needing to use a spray, so that's good. Yeah, this is no doubt where the key is. I wish I could attack him from behind, but it's fine. Hey there, guy. Have some purples on your face. Isn't that hilarious? All right. Uh, the hole is either going to be here or over there. One or the other. Is anything in here? Seemingly no. Uh, Louis, you stand over here. Olimar, you stand over here, I guess. Because that's just it. It's going to be one or the other, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm just. I want to keep an eye on that, because I want to. Oh. Wow, really? Why is it there? Wow, uh, both of you guys were wrong, turns out. That's so weird. Why would it just be near the landing spot? That, I mean, whatever, I guess. <laughs> if you say so. All right, sub-level two. What we got today? All right, we got some shenanigans, probably. Um, okay. Not a lot of shenanigans. Could have been more shenan- There is shenanigans right there. There is shenanigans in living form. You're just pushing that guy. What are you doing, man? What are you What are you doing? I mean, if you're gonna leave, I guess I'm gonna take advantage of the fact that you left and take care of these flame jets. I am going to use a bitter spray, but I'm going to try to not. I really tried to press the button sooner than that, and it didn't work out. Just make sure that guy is dead. I really don't care much else. Alright, 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 alright. Oh, you are still existent. I, I thought you were dead already. You were not, turns out. I am very surprised I didn't actually wake that guy up until exactly now. Um... All right, cool. I did not wish to wake you up yet. Th that guy is very weird. If, you know, it's honestly funny, because if he hadn't have gotten pushed, he probably wouldn't have been close enough to wake up. So... that That's just the reality here. All right, because I can probably... The trick with killing these guys, you need to make sure the purple Pikmin actually get, like, a flight arc. Because if they don't, then they're not going to do the pound move, cause stun and all that. It's kind of a tricksy thing to do sometimes, because, you know... Please, actually, one of you land on top of these guys. That'd be cool. I don't know how many purples I have left, because, I mean, I didn't really pay that close attention to who all I lost during that fight. I don't think I have a reason to break these, but... Let's do it anyway, I guess. Or at least start to. Louis, watch what's going on over here. I left some treasures behind, so I'm gonna wanna grab those. All right, dudes, get these here, please, and thank you. All right. Look at that red guy go, he's trying his best. Unfortunately, he's very slow. Uh, but you know what? It's fine. We'll just we'll just move on. I still have a fair amount of purples, so that's good. Apparently, all I care about is purple. This is gonna be water zone. Yep, there's water. I knew there'd be water. I I knew there'd be water. Okay. There is, however, a queen. Oh, that's a question, though. There's a lot of them, actually. What the heck, man? Um. Hmm. I mean, blue seems the logical thing, but I don't know what's going to be on the next floor. I'll get a blue. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get a red. I don't think I need yellow. I don't think I do. Uh, it just doesn't seem like... Oh, well, I guess I'm getting yellow anyway. 
That's fine. It's not that big of a deal. I mean, that's probably in some ways for the best because if there's any electricity at all in like the next floor, then I will be prepared. But I just don't expect it. Because generally, if there was going to be electricity, it would have been like very visible already. So, you know, I wanted a bit more blue because obviously there's fiery bull blacks over here. I'm gonna end up using a bitter spray and I'm not really all that happy about it. Um, so, it's just how it is, I guess. All right, you guys hang out over here for a moment. I'm gonna need to go adventuring, as it were. Let's take care of business. All right, I need you to wake up and be in the water. Where's a good place to hang out? I didn't even see this other fire jet right here. It was obscured by the plant life. All right. I'm glad this guy is a very sound sleeper because some of these are just not. Uh, yeah, just break that. I might want some nectar just in case. And they could have done that a little bit better, but it's fine. All right, wake you up. Please walk over to here into the water. All right, let's just get rid of you because I ain't having any of this nonsense. All right, good. I, I was momentarily worried that it wouldn't be enough because that would just be my luck. You know, we haven't seen like a spray come out of any of these in a while. I was kind of wondering if maybe that might happen, but it didn't. Was that the only treasure in this floor? That seems odd to me, but I mean, okay, I guess if you want, that that's, that's your choice, I suppose. Let's go. Sub level four, I have a feeling in the pit of my chest. Yep, we're, we're doing this, all right. And this is going to be the Empress. Uh, we're on the other side though, which is weird. I'm kind of okay with that because I don't have to deal with the babies like at all then. I don't know if this means we're gonna have rocks. There are no rocks, okay. I should probably get rid of this flame jet while I got a chance. Probably a good idea. All right, this should be relatively safe. It's just a matter of taking my time. All right, baby, look out! You didn't look out very good, baby. You could have looked out a little bit better. Truly a tragedy, most foul. I had a feeling you were gonna flail there and you didn't, but I mean, I'm not gonna complain, I guess. Oh no! Not another baby! Truly a tragedy. I remember WarioWare, how there was that one micro game where you roll Empress Bullblacks around to crush all the Pikmin. Good times. <laughs> good times. <laughs> what a good micro game that was. Uh, it's too bad you had to kill the Pikmin instead of killing babies. Can you imagine how much better that micro game might have been? I got afraid you were gonna flail again, but you didn't. I'm, I'm pretty okay with you not flailing, to be honest. Cause uh, that's just kind of a rude thing that you do and I'm not really a fan. All right, this should be the death. Should be, okay, good. All right, cool. Everybody grab that, De defeat the baby. I almost said delete the baby. I was gonna get that nectar for multiple peeps, but I guess that ain't happening. Uh, I mean, very clearly, I, I wonder where the hole is going to appear. Could it possibly be here? Wow, was I correct? I can't believe it. Wow, I'm standing inside the hole. I'm the best. <laughs> Everybody get out of the fire. Look, come on. I know you're immune because of cutscene immunity and all that, but stop. All right, this is gonna be something. 
The final floor, the end of all ends. There are Emperor Bullblax. Who has oddly been strangely absent this entire time. I realize now. Um, so that's cool. Uh, okay, there's one there in the water. Let, I really wish I had gotten more blues now, because uh, it looks like I'm going to need to deal some damage with the blues. I'm going to leave Louie over here as backup, but uh, should be fine as is. Uh, same strategy as before. I need to get him to eat the bombs so that he will be stunned. Please come over here. I am a tasty Olimar. Let's get a spray going just so I can hopefully expedite this. All right, that takes care of you. I'm gonna hope I can just kind of like fight you guys in quick succession. That'd be pretty good. You wanna get over here? I have the tastiest Pikmin in the world. The tastiest. All right, throw Pikmin at him until he dies. I'm standing not really close enough, but it's fine. All right, I have one more spray in case I need it. I need you to wake up, buddy. Please, you wanna, you wanna wake up? All right, cool. Get over here, guy. A tasty treat for you. You know what? Let's just let's just do it. Let's do the thing. End his life. Okay. So that's good. Let's get this all situated. Hopefully, y'all don't run into the fire. Did I was gonna say? Am I seriously short, Pikmin? Because I shouldn't be. Alright, where's that at? That's right next to where I'm at. This was actually relatively painless, but a lot of that comes down to the fact that this is not Pikmin 1 Emperor Bulblax. <laughs> He's kind of a pushover in comparison, which is a little bit unfortunate. Just a little bit. Like, he could have been far more threatening, I feel. Uh, but it is what it is. Alright, everybody grab that. Everybody else, uh, you should be able to, well, I mean, the blue Pikmin are doing the work of two over here, apparently. I'll just go ahead and grab that. Uh, do I have red dudes available for purchase? Well, I mean, as long as they're quick, the fire shouldn't be an issue. Just, just go, guys. All right, cool. Get that going. All right, now I need to get the blues back so I can go and get the gyroid over in the corner. Yeah, this is, this is just kind of the anticlimactic cleanup portion of this level. You know, we're just, uh, you just kind of pick up all the stuff. You guys gonna walk into the fire? I mean, yes, but not the way I expected. Please get into my whistle. Like, come on, guys. <laughs> Why are you breaking bomb rocks? Stop that. Now I gotta wait even longer. You're ruining my time bonus, kids. <laughs> Why would you do that? That's just, that's just rude. You don't break another guy's time bonus. Did I need one more? I needed one more. I mean, I got two. It's not exactly one more, but it is, it is something. All right, well, that does it for all of this, apparently. Uh, still got a lot of time, actually. This is relatively painless, all things considered. I don't know why you guys are going after the fire, but you know what, whatever, you do you. Let's create some fireworks. I've done it. I've succeeded where others have failed. You guys are just kind of casually running around in the water over there. I don't think I didn't see that. I mean, to be fair, the geyser itself is probably a danger, so, I mean, you know. I've done it! I've cleared challenge mode. I did it! I beat my score in every one except for, like, one stage, I think. I, I don't actually recall. But that's challenge mode. Uh, you might be wondering. 
Uh, if you do in fact get pink flowers on everything, you do unlock something. Let's go take a quick peek at what that might be. Welcome to the winter title screen. It's pretty great. Uh, over here in the bonuses area, you can watch all of the cutscenes in the game. Uh, getting all the pink flowers unlocks Louie's Dark Secret. It's Louie's Dark Secret! See? There he is! The president entrusted Louie with all the golden pick pick carrots. Like a smart person would do. And then Louie couldn't suppress his powerful hunger anymore, so he ate the entirety of the ship. I mean the carrots. Sorry, I got really confused for a moment. Uh, and then he came back and he's like, hey, there's a ravenous space bunny or whatever. I hope you believe that. Anyway, that's what caused this whole game to happen, is Louie being himself. Don't worry, Louie, I won't tell anyone. No one will ever know about your dark secret. Anyway. <laughs> uh, I think there's a few other little things I might do in a bonus video, but beyond that, that's it for Pikmin 2. Yeah, buddy. See you later, and goodbye. Thank you.